Hello, this is Brett from Survival Com. So today is a quick tech tip about preserving treasure. On the table here in front of me are a bunch of legacy RF adapters, and these are the good quality ones. These aren't the ones that you'll see being sold on eBay and on Amazon and places like that. These are the ones that'll cost you a small fortune to go out and purchase. Now. You can do what I do and go to like the Hamp Fest and stuff like that and pick these up for a dollar or so because they're tarnished and the people that are holding on to them typically want to get rid of them. Well, how do we go ahead and clean these up? Well, the answer is really simple and we're going to talk about that right now. So this is what we're talking about here. You can see these are in pretty good shape, but they're pretty heavily corroded and tarnished. So what is the easiest way to clean these things you know you could painstakingly clean these by hand or a very simple way is just with a liquid media tumbler and this is what I'm talking about here all it is is a motor that's turning one shaft and then we have another axle here with a couple rollers on it and it's spinning this drum right here and in this drum we have the material we wish to be cleaned which in our example here is our RF adapters We have the stainless steel tumbling media, which is nothing more than little stainless steel pins. And then we just add a little bit of water and perhaps just a tiniest dash of dish soap and let it run for about an hour. Now that we've got our tumbler loaded, go ahead and set it for an hour. Let her run. What's nice about using the tumbler is, is while you're cleaning your RF connectors, you can work on something else important. Okay, go ahead and get yourself a pan. This is just an old cat litter pan. And then I have a homer bucket and I have a strainer here that I can revolve and get the media out of everything. And then we've drained our container with the RF connectors and our tumbling media. And what we'll do is we'll go ahead and just pour this stuff right into here. And get everything out. Close this up. And this will all this slowly. And this separates our connectors from our tumbling media. Now stop turning. Pull your pin. Open up the clamshell and then put your RF adapters and connectors, etc., into the rinse water. Pull everything out of the rinse water individually and leave them out in the sun to allow them to dry. You can blow them out with an air compressor if you desire to do so as well. Now while they're drying, take the opportunity to hand inspect all the connectors and make sure there's no pins. On occasion you'll find, like this right here, you'll see there's a pin that got stuck in there. And all you do is just pull that out with a small pair of pliers and you put that in your rinse water. 
and just hand inspect each and every connector. So you can see that did a pretty good job of cleaning these up compared to what they looked like before. It's like look at this panel connector. We couldn't even read any of the writing before. And this thing has been around a long doggone time. Clean and shiny RF adapters. I hope this helps. This is Brett from Survival Comms. Till next time.